what is up you guys it is the next day i didn't end up going back out after i took my break yesterday which is all good today is a new day it's wednesday and we are back at it it is 12 39 and we got our first order of the day so let me go ahead and pull it up our first order of the day is a single order $14.19 going about 4.3 miles it is a $10 delivery fee and a $4 tip on there it's only 19 items and it's going to a house which is pretty pretty good um i will say as i turned i always turn on my app like probably 30 minutes early before i start working just to kind of see like what orders are coming in so when i turned on the app before the 12 20 drop i was getting a lot of like asap orders and they weren't bad um so i'm hopeful that today is going to be a good day but before i accepted this order i did get a order that was trash i got a nine it was like 9.9 .9 miles for thirteen dollars i'm like uh, uh no I'm not taking that and then before that i got a order which wasn't really bad it was um nine dollars for 1.1 miles but i'm like you know i don't know if i'm gonna get an order after i drop off that order so i wanted something a little bit higher so fourteen dollars is a little bit higher so i will go ahead and take that and um we're gonna continue with the doordash and everything today as well you guys so it is 12 40 we're gonna get ready to go ahead and drive on over to the stalls and get checked in and get this money today that last trip was super easy knew exactly where it was so we came back up to the walmart and we got this order 15 dollars and seven cents going 5.6 miles it is again a single order i really like the single orders you guys um and it's at another walmart so we're going to go ahead and drive on over to the other walmart now this is extra large they do have 65 items um and 165 units the units to me don't really mean anything because literally they have 64 bags and i know they're not it's not going to be 64 bags but yeah so we are going to drive over to the store and by that time i should be ready to check in but y'all one thing that kind of bothers me i'm not even gonna lie with walmart and how they pack the orders they will literally give you a whole bunch of bags right but they'll have like one item in the bag it's like no fill the bags you know you don't want it to where it's like so heavy that it could break but like fill the bag so i'm not carrying a hundred bags and like it's just not even necessary so let me know if y'all walmart do that too where you have like a whole bunch of bags and it's like y'all could have put all of this stuff in like two bags and been fine i don't know but yeah so it's still raining y'all it's been like i said it hasn't stopped raining so hopefully it stops raining soon because i don't really like the rain but yeah we're gonna go drive on over and do this order i have been seeing very low 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 pay, low pays with high miles i don't know what that's all about i got a 24 a 20 dollar um order going 24 miles uh -uh, not gonna cut it like nine miles for like 15 i'm uh -uh, not gonna cut it i need my money i need my two dollars a mile that's what i need so. so i was a little bit nervous picking up that last order because for whatever reason the last like maybe three or four times I've picked up from the store I've literally had to cancel because the wait is just so long and ridiculous and I'll literally see cars come and go but today it was all good they took care of me and I'm happy so um after that trip we were on our way back I was gonna be done for the day but this order popped up on my screen and I was like uh yeah we gonna go ahead and take this $37.06 going 9.2 miles it is two drop-offs one of them is a extra large about 54 items um the other one i think is an apartment and it's about eight items so i'm like you know what not too bad not bad at all we'll go ahead and do that y'all 24 dollar tip okay so we will take it yesterday i think i had a 37 dollar order i'm gonna go in here and see if it clear actually let's see yeah i had a 37 dollar and then my tip was 24 dollars okay y'all it cleared okay so this is from yesterday it says they cleared so good so got that 37 from yesterday so this 37 like i said it's a 24 dollar tip again so hopefully i'm pretty sure it's just from one person since they got 54 items um so hopefully that clears 
and that'll be that'll be good um so one thing with the tips though i noticed because i do order my groceries through walmart spark um and get them delivered i do notice that if you're not careful the tip is like all the way at the bottom after you've done all the steps and it automatically like selects i, I think it's like a percentage of however much you spend um and so i think one day i had just got like I don't know what I had got, but it was like um, household items, right? Literally, the tip was like $20, and I'm like, uh, 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 no. So, I had to change it, but I was almost about to hit, like, submit, and then um, it would have, you know, the next day it would have charged my card. So, I'm like, maybe that is what happens to a lot of people if, if they're not paying attention. The tip that Walmart puts on there is way more than what they would do if they would tip at all um so just just if you're wondering sometimes if you're still getting tip baited that could be one of the reasons why you're being tip baited because they probably need a better way or make it more bolder or more pronounced so people can actually see or make it like its own separate page so people know because like i said it's literally at the bottom right before you hit like place order they how many orders i think i only did like three or four orders today which isn't bad but y'all know i like spark to kind of like jump in jump out like double dutch i like to jump in jump out if i got something to do i jump out and then when i free jump back in so yeah all right y'all i will check you guys once we get everything loaded <music> you guys i am done for the day the end of the day kind of redeemed itself i'm not gonna lie but by far this is like me for two days um granted yeah i wasn't able to work a full like five hour six hour shift i kind of picked up here and there but this is what you can do if you don't have that much time you just have time you know kind of here and there to pick up drop off you can definitely do walmart spark to make you some extra money so i'll go ahead and put my two-day total on the screen and yeah everything went good today no complaints so i will be back at it tomorrow so i'll see you guys in the next video so if you enjoyed this video go ahead and leave me a shopping cart emoji and as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.